for uh, the rest of your weekend. We are unfortunately looking at some very wet conditions going over the next 24 hours, but tonight we're transitioning over toward winter. The season begins in about three and a half hours at 10 19. It will officially become winter, even though we've been pretty cold already so far. The fall season is going to end on a wet note as we continue to see scattered showers filling in on radar here. This has been the picture throughout the day today. At least we're starting to work in a few breaks with this going into uh, the rest of the evening and overnight hours as we see the heaviest rainfall across parts of Mississippi, Alabama and the Florida Panhandle. But we just continue to see this moisture filling in. And so as we go into Sunday, We'll still have some pretty high rain chances as you see by midnight. Some scattered shower potential continues into the overnight hours early Sunday morning. Some more breaks in the rain for tomorrow, even though we had some heavier rain throughout much of the day today. I see more breaks in the forecast tomorrow going into the afternoon. Some scattered showers though will continue. We won't really see the rain chances diminish completely until we go into Monday. Monday morning still a few lingering showers and then going into the afternoon. We'll start to see the drier air taking over and some sunshine will be in the forecast going into Christmas Eve. So your forecast rainfall totals are going to be on the light side through the rest of this event through early on Monday. Some heavier rain along the Mississippi Gulf Coast and then some lighter amounts across southeast Louisiana. Just a pesky light to moderate rain will continue. Eight tenths of rain has fallen so far over at the New Orleans Airport. We're two and a half inches for the month. We've had 62 inches of rainfall for the year and that's an inch and a half above the normal for the year. As you see, the totals have added up pretty quickly over toward the lakefront. I had it up to an inch today, eight tenths over toward the Slidell area, over a half of an inch for you at Bogalusa and over that over toward Galliano. High temperatures today because of the cloud cover and the rain have been in the mid to the upper 50s. And as we look at your temperature trend, we're warming up going toward Christmas Day. So if you were hoping for a white Christmas, well, you're gonna have to keep hoping for next year because we're going to continue to see this warming trend. Average high is 64, so we'll be back in the mid 60s going into early next week. And we say goodbye to the rain chances early on Monday. Then we're looking good for Christmas Eve and on Christmas Day. Speaking of that forecast, starting out the morning around 52 degrees, partly cloudy, a mixture of sun and clouds by the afternoon. Going to be a nice day for the kids to go out and play with their new toys. Let's take a live look. Outside the Mercedes-Benz Superdome, a little bit of a break from the rain, but some wet roadways, 54 degrees. That rain still falling over toward the Kenner Airport. As we look at your seven day forecast, we'll continue to see the rain chances diminishing, the sunshine returning and the temperatures warming up as we head toward Christmas and the end of next week.